Farber gave me hope, as uh, as Lee said, but it also constantly uh, gave me new alternatives. As, and I thought about this as the uh, policeman from uh, Worcester was on, because if you come into a problem, because you're at Dana Farber and the Jimmy Fund, and you know there is such uh, world class research going on as well as world class treatment, um, there is always seems to be a plan B or a plan C or a plan D or here's another alternative, uh, and that sense of uh, of hope is embedded in the institution. Uh, the people do. Th thorough uh, and, and, and groundbreaking research. At the same time, they treat you like a, a one-of-a-kind special guest. And um, the, the combination uh, allows you to, to maintain some sense of hope and optimism. But, but and you're, you're the guy, Larry. You're the guy. You're at the start of the Pan Mass every year. You're here with us every year. Yeah. We've been over at the uh, Dana-Farber for ceremonies, for ribbon cuttings. You're always there. If you're not with this club anymore, if your role has been diminished, uh, uh, well, it, I mean, my, my role is to manage. Understand that uh, I'm going to take a lesser, okay, well, much lesser role, role part-time job Red going Sox forward. Have, or the relationship with the Jimmy Fund is that going to change without you? Uh, I don't think so. I th uh, Tom and uh, uh, Warner and, and John Henry walked over to the went, uh, Dana Farber the uh, first uh, or second week we were here, and we uh, we went to the Jimmy Fund and we talked about how important uh, this this uh, uh, institution was to the Red Sox, to New England, and to the world of uh, cancer research. And uh, I think their commitment is as, uh, as deep uh, uh, as mine. And I certainly am going to stay active in the, in the Jimmy Fund. And I, uh, I know that uh, there'll be some day when we'll be celebrating the 100th anniversary of the Jimmy Fund Red Sox uh, uh, partnership. What are you excited about coming up on your plate, Doc? Well, I'm getting as old as him. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, am I, what am I excited about? The thing that I'm most excited is about is beginning to think about something that we've never thought about before. You know, w when you're a kid, you're born with this genetic profile, and um, things start to happen in your life. We've always waited for the disease to happen and then respond mm. and then invent new things. I think all across Boston, not only at Dana-Farber, but all across Boston, we're beginning to think, beginning to think of how we can tip the, the, the things that change your genetics to give you disease. Once we know that, um, I think these diseases will be prevented or thwarted before Larry gets, starts to cough on a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. We'll know what to watch for. Right now, we're responders. And I'm hoping in my lifetime, Larry's lifetime, um, we're predictors.